Hi, Chip. Chip. We're, We're Carrie and, and Kelly Rife. Rife. We have three kids, Ian, Devin, and Kara. And, and our, our dream, dream is this fixer-upper. Fixer -upper. Three years ago, we started Awaken Church in our family room, then moved to an office space, then to a charter school, and now we meet at a performing arts center in Higley. The dream is to buy the old potato barn and make it a church with a big emphasis on community. We want to make this small building a teen center to be used after school because we're right between two high schools along this railroad track. We'll put in a big playground and a covered basketball court next to the teen center. We'll create picnic tables and a grassy area so the families in the community can come and play and just watch the trains go by. The loading dock will be perfect as a stage for concerts and events. On November 22nd, 2017, God led us to a 40-day prayer challenge to end out the year. He also led me to read Deuteronomy 11:22 to 32, and it says, "If you obey all I command, every place your foot treads will be yours." At the same time, I felt like God was leading us to pray for the potato barn. I walked around the property, timed it, and it took me exactly 11 minutes and 22 seconds. Out of the blue, on 11:22, someone from Oklahoma sent us $1,000 for a building fund. My parents were pastors of a church here in Arizona on a triangle-shaped piece of property that was 4.9 acres. The potato barn sits on the triangle-shaped piece of property that is exactly 4.9 acres. We want to see our spiritual heritage live on. We want to awaken this old landmark and see it be a place of gathering the harvest once again. Only this time not for potatoes, but for people. This reminds us a lot of your silos. We think it's right up your alley. What we're asking for is your mentorship to help us put together a design plan and create a proposal that we can put in front of others so that we can pursue funding to buy and restore this old tater barn. 